Did not our hearts burn within us as he spoke to us on the road while he opened the scriptures to us? Welcome to episode one of the Trough Podcast. I'm your host, Nathan Zach. Absolutely love those words from two of Jesus' disciples on the road to Emmaus. You can find that one in Luke 24. And man, if that's our goal for each episode, uh, if you would, by the end of the episode, your heart would be in the condition of those two disciples from seeing Christ in the text, uh, we will have done everything that ever came into our heart for this podcast. We just absolutely uh, love uh, that idea of encountering Christ uh, in the scriptures and beyond the idea we love the reality of it we know as disciples of Christ that the way to meet him uh, in truth is by way of his word and that's what we're going to do here at the trough we're going to open God's word and encounter God and the more that we see him the more that we'll love him and the more that we'll want to see him uh, and then we will ultimately one day all be with him in glory uh, that's a verse that's very near and dear to my heart but before we go any further, uh, a very important note that I want to share with you right at the outset of our very first episode as it relates to how this podcast is going to operate. Um, we do not, again, we do not, are not trying to replace your local church or your local church pastor. We exist as a help for those who are looking for an additional keyword, additional resource to assist you in your Christian life and your Christian development. The trough fully supports the function and the viability of the local church as the primary means of grace from God to his people. OK, so that's a very, very important note that we wanted to share with you right at the top of episode one of the trough podcast. OK, so now that we've handled that part, what is a trough? I know what you're thinking. I mean, this is a crazy name for a podcast, but what is a trough and why did we choose to name our podcast after one? Well, if you didn't know, a trough is an instrument used in a common instrument, in fact, used in feeding and providing nourishment for animals. Wherever the trough would be placed would become a place where the livestock, all the animals would come and be fed. We, of course, are, are wanting to borrow that image in creating this podcast, naming it the trough. We want to create a place where his sheep as the Bible calls us uh, in verses like Psalm 103, which says, know that the Lord, he is God. It is he who has made us and not we ourselves. We are his people, the sheep of his pasture. Also, you'll see us referenced to uh, as sheep uh, in, Ex in Ezekiel 34, chapter 12, as well as famously in uh, the great chapter, John 10, where Jesus, we see Jesus as the good shepherd and we are his sheep lay down his life for the sheep uh, so you I'm sure you're familiar with that passage so we, we really wanted to create a space like what you would have with a feeding trough where the saints the sheep could come together and be fed from God's holy word so four areas that we will cover on this podcast on the trough podcast now that you know what a trough is first we're going to do topical discussions on theology and biblical doctrine. Now, I know uh, many of you may not have a very high regard for the word words like theology or biblical doctrine. And I know in a lot of circles, those are things that we avoid because we don't want to get into an argument or anything like that. But we're going to tackle those topics. We want to think about God. We want to talk about God. We want to consider God. We want to consider what the whole counsel of, of God's word says about him and teaches about him uh, because we believe that right thinking leads to right feeling which leads to right worship so we want to get our minds renewed and focused uh, on god by way of what the bible teaches about him and how we should approach him and serve him so we're going to talk theology we're going to talk biblical doctrines if you're not going to seminary uh, and you're interested in soteriology, uh, this is going to be the place for you. Uh, we'll tackle that and a whole, man, whole bunch more ologies as well. So that's going to be uh, right off the top. We're going to get into a lot of topical discussions on theology and Bible doctrine. Number two, we're going to provide answers to biblical misconceptions and answer questions that you may have about God, Bible, or biblical living. I know there's a lot, especially uh, new believers, they start reading, they're reading things that they can't make sense of, don't understand. I know that was the case for me, uh, and I needed help. I needed answers. So uh, I know all of us don't may not have someone we can turn to and ask some of the 
some of these questions that come into our minds as we're reading the text. Uh, but you can always email us here at the Trough Podcast, and we'll be there for you. The uh, email address is info at the troughblog.com. Again, that's info, I N F O, at the troughblog.com. And we will answer your questions as comprehensively as we possibly can. I'll share that answer on a future episode. Number three, we're going to do scripture reading and scripture meditations. Um, we're going to be recording here in the near future portions of scripture, chapters, entire chapters. We're, we're going to read those and upload them and send them out in, uh, in podcast form so that you can have them uh, accessible to you while you're working out, resting or going in on your morning commute. Uh, and you just want to hear some some scripture, some Bible. I know that's one thing I love to do, especially before bed is just have the Bible playing uh, so I can go to bed with it. Uh, with my mind saturated with the word of God. So we're going to be recording uh, chapters of the Bible uh, and then uploading them on the Trough Podcast. And then you'll be able to just with one click, just click and you'll be able to hear those. Some of the, your favorite chapters and you can even email us suggestions on chapters you'd like us to record. And we will. Um, we are also going to do scripture meditations where uh, through our daily devotional reading that we do, that I do personally, um, just verses that really stir the heart, really uh, God really captures and arrests our attention. We want to share those verses with you because we believe that if it's life giving to us, it will probably be life giving to you as well. So we want to take some of those verses and just kind of exegete them line by line, phrase by phrase, and really dig deep into them to to mine them for the richness that God has placed in his holy word. Uh, in fact, one of our very next episodes that we're going to do on the Trough podcast will be a scripture meditation coming from Psalm 37. So we're looking forward to sharing that with you as well. Uh, and the last thing we're going to do on this podcast is we're going to have messages that I've preached uh, both at my local congregation, my local fellowship, and as in an itinerant fashion uh, uploaded on the trough as well, that you'll be able to also download those uh, so you can have them on your device or listen to them right on uh, the, the blog website. Or you can even access them too by, uh, I, by way of iTunes. Um, so we'll have messages up on various topics. I know there's one up now on the sovereignty of God, which we did uh, a couple of months ago. And those are just there for your edification as well. The Trough Podcast is an extension, of course, of our blog. And you can find that at www.thetroughblog.com. Again, that's thetroughblog.com, T-H-E-T-R-O-U-G-H blog.com. There you're going to find more articles, teachings, book reviews, ebooks, and we're adding content constantly. So you'll want to go there, subscribe, and you'll be notified whenever we add anything new uh, on the blog. So that's about it. Uh, I know that was kind of a fast meet and greet, but that's episode one. We look forward to many more episodes to come to the glory of God. Uh, I'm your host, Nathan Zach. Remember, you can find us at the troughblog.com. Until next time, God bless you all.